doesn't seem like a good idea. Welcome! Blake! Blake! Oh, no, Blake. Okay. Okay. Welcome to Ninja Gaiden. Ha! Look at that, I survived that. Uh, I'm with the Super Spears Brothers. I am Super. This is Spears. Hey. Um, we're playing a little bit of Ninja Gaiden 2. The Dark Sword of Ansari. Mm. Um, the Dark Sword of Kaos. It's uh, written by Faust. Um, not the one that you're thinking of, the other Faust. Yeah, one, one of the many other Fausts. What, what is this? Ooh, look at... Have we I kind of want to jump into those spikes. This looks like... Should I jump into those spikes? Don't jump into the spikes. Okay. The, this, the, the, I think they actually... Whoa, whoa, whoa. Are these brain crustaceans? What are those? They look like just like you've entered the land of the lobsters. What is this? It's like lobsters with, with bad tumors. Basically. These... Well, that bird would not be Why there. Why is there just an eagle this far underground? How are we in Mega Man and Castlevania at the same time? Oh, I ha if I had my, my throwing star, that would have been useful though. And Jason, whatever. This, sure. this is like such a... Wait, 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 wait. Can we just listen to the music for a second? Wait, don't jump into the fire. What? I don't just die? <laughs> It actually just does damage to me. Wait, listen to this fire, the music for a second. It's really happy. Yeah, it is. Hey, the spikes and the fire, all beneath. And there's spikes. You're gonna die. Jason's with a bunch of skeletons. Some guy's gonna throw something into your head, and it's gonna be. You're gonna be dead. What the? I, I say the fire doesn't kill you; it just does damage. No, no. Did you not notice though that that guy he falls down from the ceiling for no reason? Why can't I climb? Why can't I face that way? What the hell is going on? <sighs> okay, fine. there you go. Okay, so apparently you just start here. Uh, up there is a full mana. Don't bother trying to kill this guy. If you're just gonna go up like you can't. Okay. <laughs> Um, do I need full mana? I guess I do. Uh, I'll probably collect it over time, though. Yeah, at this point, like once you once you got this far, there's no point going going for it. Right. If you go right away, then the enemies won't respawn. But then you have to fight over. What hit, hit me there? A bullet. I, just, I didn't see it. it must have, see, look, that bullet's glitching out. Yeah, I guess it's. You know, I might just commit suicide, like. Uh, well, Brendan, if you're gonna do that, make sure you have worked out our whole recording schedule first. Ah, uh, yes. Because we don't want to miss an episode. No, that'd be terrible. And then you'd have to be in charge of uploading, and then who knows what'll happen. That's right. Okay, now watch me just carve through this whole area without getting a single damage. I like how soon you always say that right after you get hit. Yeah, well, if I said it just before I got hit, it would seem stupid. <laughs> Fair enough. I haven't looked at the camera yet. Hi, guys. How's it going? I'm gonna stop wasting the frame. Look at all the space I'm wasting. I'm taking this off with arm wave in this shit. <laughs> Go on, shit. Start shitting. Oh, I shit instead. Oh. You know what's funny about me? And this isn't funny at all. What? You know what's uninteresting about me in any way? What? You know what nobody in their right mind could possibly be even a little bit interested in? You? What po nobody could possibly be interested in is the fact that, like, I die a lot just trying to get one item that, like, there's no reason to care about. Mm -hmm. I like how that guy just waits a little while and then just decides, you know what, oh, fuck it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not waiting for this guy any longer. <sighs> I keep getting stuck. We're gonna... After this run-through, we're gonna have to take a break on this whole thing. The being a ninja thing? Wow, that was nicely done. Yeah, thank you. You just killed that guy like nobody's business. What I mean is, it's nobody's business that you killed that guy. It's nobody's business you hear me. Nobody. Oh, how'd that bat hit me? You know, you know who's a, you know who's good for nothing? Who? Thanos. That that guy. Are you really gonna make this joke again? We didn't do it on the show. I know. You made. You, this is the second time you've made this joke. Maybe you'll join in this time. <laughs> no, I refuse. Maybe you'll cooperate. I refuse in general points of I made a Thanos pun. You're gonna take it. He's bringing nothing. He's, he brings nothing to the to the story. He brings infinite. So you can climb on that, it's just for some reason it was not allowing you before. Uh, and here's some more tumor lobsters. Hmm, what's on the catch of the day? Well, we've got tumor lobsters. Uh, do you have anything less tumory? Well, I've got these um, squids. 
that are um, missing all their tentacles due to a accident when they were a teenager. No, it's uh, still kind of disgusting. Uh, well, Does Squid even have a teenage year period? They have a poly period. That's true. Um, they've, they're polyps. Polyps. This music is just so cheery. I know, it's hard and to... incongruous. <laughs> and that's not even a skeleton, I've realized. That's actually some sort of fleshman. Is it? And yeah. Look at him. He's, he's yeah, got flesh. He's rotting like, flesh, yeah. He's just sort of like... The one, this, here's the most horrible thing that could happen to you. You live on just as, like, rotten flesh. Oh, get it, get it, get it, get it. Yeah, I can't stick to this wall for some reason. Well, it's okay. It's worth it for the, uh, for the ninja scroll. It totally is. Oh. 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 I wonder what your maximum amount of magic is, and whether when you get to the last boss, it's just like, oh, you don't have 120 magic? You're probably not going to beat him. Uh, I'm guessing, knowing this game, yes. <laughs> then you have 120 magic, it's like, oh, you don't... You don't have... You're just not going to beat him. <laughs> you didn't collect Sorry. the health power-ups? Oh yeah, there's two of them. They're hidden inside pits that you die when you fall into, but you have to not die when you fall into them. Ah. Look at this. Oh, uh, this is like full on Mega Man in you. Ah, uh, that may really made me remember uh V V V V V V V V V V V V V V V V Is that the sequel Vendetta? Is that the sequel to V Yeah, it's the sequel to V Vendetta. I I always figured that like that game it should be should be said like you're like um a child driving a toy car. Totally. It's like, hey, let's go play some V Are you ready to play V Oh look! I made I made progress! Oh my goodness, there's a plot thing. <laughs> Why are there so many lights shining on me for no reason? Well, the doctors with the immortal blood. I change his voice every time. He shall receive the power of the almighty evil. Is this just like a like a like a montage type thing? I think so. The legend shall come true. This earth shall fall into shadow and the demons of evil shall rule forever. Hey, wait, we wanted to do another cut here. Let's just make the picture bigger. <laughs> He's got two different kinds of laughs. I'll get you, Ashtar, and your little dog, too! <laughs> Is he the villain? Yeah, that's right, he's the villain. Oh, okay. And the time, Ashtar's like, I just want to run my own little corporation of you. Oh, good. Ice. And you have this three, is what this game needed. And you have three hit points. The ice, too, it looks in this to be completely unforgiving. Like, you're just sliding. Look, look. <laughs> you're just sliding for a ludicrous amount of time. There's just, like, like... Uh, physics is walking in here, and physics is going like, oh, I ain't touching that shit. Not this shit again. <laughs> I'm, I'm so done with this. I'm done. And then like at this point, all the birds and everything just kind of float away and like <sighs> into into entropy. Physics is like, you fucked with the wrong guy. <sighs> you you fucked with physics. You get the end of everything that makes sense. Look, you're in five two, so five one had a cutscene in between it that yeah, made that's no really sense weird. and added like virtually nothing to the plot. It was like, yeah. He, Demons of Evil, I guess. It was nice. Yeah, it was fine. And then he was like, I'm going to say the same thing I always say. It's just because of the voice you gave him, but I can't not think of you as just a whiny teenager now. Oh, yeah. Even though it's totally not his character. He's more of a... just a dude, I guess. What, what, if you had to describe his personality, what would it be? Um, surprised? <laughs> He's always like, Huh? huh? That's true. He's that, that's why anime voice is the right voice for him, because he's got that kind of like... Nani! What's that? What? What? His character would be the one with the oddly deep voice, despite the fact that he's drawn to look like a 12-year-old. Oh, that's right. So he should, should actually have like a... Nandeska? Uh, what is this? Huh? <gasps> I guess I'm... I guess I'm facing off against Ashtar. Yeah, like an adult Yu-Gi-Oh. That's right. Oh, what, or what? space Yu-Gi-Oh, what, uh, whatever it is. Uh, the Pharaoh, whatever. I, I only know him through the Abridged series, <laughs> so... That's right. We only know... Is that, is that, is that Eagle Raptor who does that? No. Do you, that was dumb, Blake. I thought you could hook around. Look, <laughs> you get to continue from here. So it's just instantly you die because you're stupid, and it's like, oh, well... You, that, that was very forgiving when you think yeah. about it. It's like you walk into a room, you fall down because you're stupid. Yeah. And then it's like you get to come repeat here indefinitely. Well, until you get a game over. Until you get a game over, you get to repeat here. The game over in this game, like, you have unlimited continues. So it kind of makes me wish you just didn't have to go back all the way. You know yeah, what I mean? but like, I wish there was, like, one more but checkpoint. No, but it definitely, it definitely adds some challenge because you get back here, 
And then for some reason you can't beat like the level you were able to beat before. Yeah. But I, I wish I didn't just take the water. What well, was that? Bad? That was bad. As no, I just was. stopped moving. It's, God, yeah, it was bad. The ice just affected me in mid air. I think. The, the, yeah, that's possible the way these games are programmed. Badly. No, they just they didn't know what the, the they just didn't know what they were doing. They were they're, just fools. They were just fools and losers, and in the end, they died. That's true. I, probably, I wonder how many people who work in this game are still alive. Probably a lot of them. Probably a lot of them. They're Japanese, so they live forever. That's right. <laughs> the Japanese are Highlanders, right? Oh, oh, that's right. But there can only be one. Yeah. Japanese. That's person. why they keep killing themselves. There can only be one Japanese person. Every time you walk into a room and there's like a bunch of Japanese people in there, They'll most of just... them are Koreans. You just can't tell the difference because you're a huge racist. And the, at some point, they're just gonna start chopping each other's heads off. I've been told by some people that it's kind of racist that you say you can't tell the difference between one Asian and another. But isn't it a bit racist in the other way to say that like you can tell the difference from, between one person from one country and another country just by looking at them? Like, all... like that's literally racist in the sense that it, it's defining. Like, people just based on their country as having distinctive racial characteristics. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I knew that was gonna kill me! I knew that was gonna kill me! <sighs> That's the kind of stupid shit this game pulls so on. So you me. did it pur purposefully? No. I wanted to test. You have to test what the limits of the c collision boxes are. Yeah, exactly. I like how sometimes I can hit everything perfectly and be, like, do everything just the way I want it to. You know, times I'm totally useless. There's a discreet theory behind this pan guy. He is something. Because he can turn into a ball and roll around. And he has some sort of, like, claw hand things. Yeah. And he looks a bit like... There was some design put into this guy. But it, but but it's inex it's inexplicable or inexorable. He's it's, like... Well, because I'm guessing a lot of these people... Inexorable is not the right word. I, like, I don't know who any of these people are. I'm guessing some of them are demons. Well, some you see, of them one are of them just big dudes. guy with knife running at you. That sort of like has an internal logic to it. Like ninja, Dale. There's just ninja. I love the actually. I love that the ninja stars that those guys throw just float really gently down. It just seems so anticlimactic. It's like where'd that bird come from? The, the, that that's that's the, asking that ninja Gaiden is a little bit like asking why you're breathing right now. That's true. Why am I breathing right now? A bird hasn't tried to kill you yet? Oh yeah, that's right. That explains it. Ninja Gaiden! Alright, so next time on Ninja Gaiden, I'm gonna pause the game, because I'm really terrified of looking at the camera while playing.